Welcome back to ULEARN Tutorial. Let's create some shapes in Illustrator. In the Illustrator in itself, there are some geometric shapes that you can use. Hold, click on hold on their square or rectangle tote. There is a tear away. Click on this once so then it go, comes off free so it makes it have easy access to these panels here or to these tools, I should say. Inside here is a square, so if you click and drag, you can, you can draw a square or a rectangle. Close that off for a second there. If you hold on the shift key, it gives you a perfect square. If you take the rectangle tool, it's very similar. The rounded rectangle tool gives you a rounded corner or how rounded shape you want. So if I use the up key, as you can notice on my screen, it gives me more of a rounded corner. Okay. And then at the other way, if I go down, it gives me a lesser corner. At the same time here, if you wanted to, if you're drawing a, a, a square or a shape, inside here you also have, you have the out part, you have the inside curve, you can actually make a round itself as well. So either or, you can use that. Select it all, set delete, to have a clear canvas. And that circle one, same thing as a square, hold down the shift key to give you a perfect circle. If you do not hold the shift key, you can have an oval shape. Same with polygon. If you hold, if you go up, you can add many different sides to it. If you go down, you can create a polygon or a triangle. So there's another way of creating a triangle by using a polygon. Stars is very simpler as well. Again, you have a five-pointed star. If you use the up, you can have a multi-pointed starburst. If I wanted to use one of my selection tools, or my direct selection tool, again, with the selection tool, it allows you to move things around. But if you want to do some edits to this file, grab your selection tool, or hit A on your keyboard to get the direct selection tool, and then select on the points, and you can allow and go ahead to make this a weird looking shape of a starburst. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like it or share it, and also tell people about it.